And now his teacher in that first grade year was Mira Yuan, and I'm spelling it here, M-I-R-A-E-W-I-N, which is how it's spelled in the ledger books running on the top above the list of the grades for her students. I'm a little uncertain about the last name's spelling, truthfully. But, uh, uh, and she, she entered Truman's name in her first grade ledger, Harry Trum Truman, T-R-U-E-M-A-N-N. -N. Now Truman returned the favor years later by always misspelling her name, Myra, M-Y-R-A, Ewing. Um, Truman was eight years and five months old and maybe a, a, I took all the students in that first grade class, added up their ages, divided by number of students. The average student coming into first grade was about six months younger than Truman. So eight years old rather than eight years roughly, eight and a half years old. And the ages of the first graders range that I mentioned from six to 13. Now we learn from these le uh, ledgers that Truman was punctual, he was never tardy a day in his life, as far as we can, as far as we can tell. Dependable and well-behaved. He never missed a day for the rest of the year, never tardy. His deportment grade, how many of you got deportment grades when you were in school? You did, you really, you got deportment grades. Well, um, I, this is probably the most important grade you could get, just told whether or not you were a good person. I mean, the other grades would tell whether you were smart or what. But Truman got 100. Perfect deportment grade, all three terms.